go. Arrakis Swarm. Nice. Okay, so we're going to keep the squirrel for hive mind. Um, I need... I think we keep a siege ladder as well. I guess... Do we get rid of the iris for now? No, because I might not. I might never draw iris companions, so I don't really think I can afford to mulligan this. Hmm. I think we don't need this many revenants. Scary to kick iris, yeah. Uh, okay. So it's this first. Oh, actually, no, it should have been PFI first, maybe? Wait, this deck doesn't play a Dahlia, so how does this work? You play PFI, and then I leader... What should I... What? Wait, what's the... Revenants are good versus drones? They are. They are. I probably shouldn't have kicked both Revenants. I think that was a mistake. Should have kept one Revenant. I think we just Draug. Do I lead her again? I think so. We lead her Radovid. Is it overcommit? No. You want to play Draug in round one. You want to play Draug in round one because you want to get all the revenants in your graveyard by round two so that you can play Pavetta. I don't think it's overcommit. This deck always wants to play Draugr in round one. In fact, I probably should have played PFI turn one instead of reinforced Ballista. He can pass now. For the king! We retreat! We hide! So We're just trying to cycle as many of these revenants as we can. We have three in the graveyard, six more in, on the board. Okay, so... Are we playing more? Remember, we need to play a Pavetta in round two. And then we also need to play an Iris in round two. So I guess not. We need Last Say as well, because he might have a COC or something, or an Igni. Why do we need Pavetta in round two? We want shortest possible round three, but we also, like, don't we want to keep Last Say? Isn't it very risky to... To give up the last say? <laughs> Does this run death run COC? It might. It's a Tatterwing deck. Tatterwing deck, I've seen them run COC before.
Rat of it before Renfrey. Uh huh. Well, look, if we want to guarantee that we keep the last say. If we want to guarantee that we keep the last say, we should pa play only two cards. But I think that's maybe too long of a round to do that. And then they're like, their um, double, whatchamacallit, might beat us. You know what I mean? <clears throat> so I'm going to play I'm gonna play with the intention of going deep in this round. Their double uh, Lara Doran with a full board is going to beat us. Renfrey on Sabrina with Wrath is a lot of points. Yeah, that's true. So what do we want to take with... Um, we have two leader charges from Pincer Maneuver. I guess I should play this range row. We have two leader charges with Pincer Maneuver. We have an Iris Companions that can draw another card. Iris Companions can draw Renfrey's Gang. Maybe. Or Revenant. Or Sabrina Glesevig. Like, maybe we can get Revenant and Sabrina Glesevig with our leader charges. I don't even know what to replace with this hand. This hand is good. We definitely want to squirrel that, right? Maybe Sabrina if we're pushing in this round. I don't even know if we want Radovid. Radovid might be the card that we don't want. I want to play... Oh, no. Voimir we don't want. We don't really want Voimir. I don't think... Well, I we probably won't have enough Revenants unless he, unless he literally can't answer a Revenant the entire round. Maybe we'll have a row full of Revenants. Yeah, he's just going to use this to answer Revenant, right? No. We're playing in, yeah, we're playing in. We decided that he probably doesn't have COC. <coughs> Are we playing Pavetta round three or round two, chat? It is how I punish those who irritate me. Pavetta round three or round two? I can get a bigger Pavetta if we Pavetta in round three. Because the Revenant's going unanswered. Are you cold, human insect? It won't be long now. Right? We retreat behind someone to But that also means I can't play anything else. Like, I have this card I can't play, this card I can't play, this card I can't play. Okay, you know what I can do? I can leader... Okay, wait, 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 I have an idea. We put back the iris. I don't think it matters here what we do. I'm just gonna put back this too and then run free. I have scores to settle. Wrath, sloth, gluttony, wrath, patience, diligence, humility, humility. Yeah, I risk bricks round three, but they're not like like I don't really need anything else. I. I don't really need anything else, right? So I'm putting the iris back because I can just get the so iris with the companions. So much spite. All right, it's time. I should have taken cooldown. I should have taken cooldown instead of curse of wrath, uh, instead of humility pass thing. Um, so. Now it's this, this, boom! Bye bye, drones. Uh. 
Well, her for a second, let it sink in. I'm not sure if I should have taken... Yeah, I should have taken cooldown. I could have wrath for nine and then, like, wrath again in round three. Did we get envy? Uh, I did not... Ch I think it was gluttony, wrath, and sloth. Haha, <laughs> he heat waves it. He's ahead. No, he's not ahead. He's not ahead. I think we pass now. I have four more points, so we're up three right now. If I play Voimir, he plays for eight. We'll be up 11. We'll be up 11. That's not like that much. He gets ahead with Tatterwing. He gets ahead with Gels into Ardgaeth into this thing again. Yeah, I think we pass. He has no leader charges left, so he doesn't like swarm that bad that hard in round three and he just uses another swarm card so i feel like we're okay the voimir unfortunately is pretty bad in round three though like we don't have that many good cards left to play that's the bad thing is that now we have like one fewer good card that we can play these cards all suck I don't even know what I want. Like a Serquan? PFI for six? I guess Revenant. We want Revenant. Oh, nice. Okay. Perfect hand then. Perfect hand. If this Revenant lives, then the Voimir is activated and the Scytheman is also activated. <clears throat> Skill and draws indeed. Make sure you Pavetta before Iris. Yep. Opponent had to heat wave the last revenant. Yeah, and he played both natural selections. <laughs> nice. No answer. Oh my god. Nice. So these aren't going to the graveyard, right? Boy, we're good all of a sudden, yeah. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve revenants going to the deck. Twelve revenants going to the deck. He's gonna frost. Oh, maybe I should have wrath there. Maybe I should have wrath there. Let's go, Spider! Thank you for the tier one reset for 60 months. Five years. Thank you, Disco Spider. Can he kill a two? Okay. If I wrath, can I set any of these to one? No. <clears throat> I'll go here, I guess. Hmm, seems Wrath doable. now is the same points. That's true. It's the same points as earlier. Uh, this. Because it still kills three bodies. We've caught another taskmaster. Hmm. Okay. If I wait one more turn, I believe I can wrath the 3 plus 1 armor and it'll deal 2 damage to the adjacent ones and they'll both be at 1. And then I can copy my revenant. Is this big brain? Tomorrow we suffer home! Suffering? Our suffering binds us. So 19 units have two buffs each. So that's 38 buffs. Curse these elven tools. Mouths short and weapons at the ready. The Scytheman sucks! This Scytheman is so bad! 
But I think we win. I think we win. Hey, 200% win rate. Let's go. Hey, Disco Spider. So not play leader before was like four points extra. Well, we got to get the, we got to, like saving the wrath on the leader got to set up the revenants, which is very nice. This is like an ideal matchup for revenants. It is, it's so easy to get the death blows and they don't have that much control. He spent it all too. <laughs> Maybe best to end on a high note with this deck. Now we go again. We go again. Scythemen is much better round one for this deck. Scythemen is better in round one, but you also need the Voimir. Scythemen's not very good round three. What would we replace Scythemen with though? I don't I think we're just gonna run the deck as is for now. Um But we can think about if you guys have any idea. Could this be viable with inspired zeal? No, you need the pincer maneuver. This deck needs a lot of round one consistency. And so uh, to get that round one consistency, to get your PFI, to get your Draug, right? Draug's just a one of. You have to have the Pincer Maneuver. The Pincer Maneuver also helps you get your Pavetta and your Erland later on. This deck is unplayable without Pincer Maneuver. You'd have to put in so oh. many tutors, so many like Oniromancy, Royal Decree type of cards. That gets that that like is worse value for your um, Iris companions and for your Erland, and you also can't play run free. Pallor. Onslaught. Okay. That's good. Scout is good. Renfri's gang is good. Mata. Mata gets us. Graug. This looks good. Okay. Why can't you draw round two? You prevented through round three just fine. Uh. Okay. I guess that's a good question. Why can't we draw round two? Well, the problem I think is if you lose round one, if you don't have draw round one, then you lose round one, right? And then if you lose round one, hungry like a wolf, I am. then your opponent could just dry pass you round two. And if they dry past you round two, how are you going to get many revenants in your graveyard? Are you going to play PFI and Draug in round two? Fought there! Okay, there's a lot of ones, at least. At least there's a lot of ones. We do prefer to Draug round one. We definitely prefer to Draug round one. It is how I punish those who irritate me. I think other leaders allow you to win round one in other ways. Not as well, I would say. Do we care enough to scout this? I want a leader Draug. And then... Wait, no, I could Mata as well. I don't have to Leader Draug, I could Mata, but I don't know if I want to Mata. I think I might just want to Leader Draug, Leader Erland into the hand, and then just like... Yeah, and then the Scout gives me another Sorry. human body, it's okay. Sorry. I'm blue coin, he can pass any time. Like, you can't, we can't delay, we can't delay the Draug that much, right? He can pass any time. This deck might run COC. So we need to have last say. It might run COC, we really need to have last say. Okay. Um... 
<clears throat> I think we just get Traug. I don't think we want the Mata. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm... Should have TA'd something, probably. I don't know why I took the PFI. That was bad if I'm going to play Draug now. But I don't know what else I would take. Maybe I'd take Reinforced Ballista or Siege Ladder. <clears throat> Siege Ladder might have been good. Yeah, I have extra leader charges. So I could take a Siege Ladder anyways. But yeah, that could have been could have turned out a lot better. So, we take the Siege Ladder now? I think I don't click. He has a Sunset Wanderer, by the way. <clears throat> I didn't want to click because I was thinking that I want to copy with this one, right? And also, if I fill the row, I, I mean, I guess, whatever. Uh... I think we're playing down, right? I think we're playing down. Stressed out. I'm stressed out a little bit. It's pirates, they don't have 50 plus points. Uh, what do we do about Croc? Croc can kill Erland if he plays Croc. And Justiana can also kill Erland. There are some concerns. There are some concerns, not gonna lie. Revenant auto dies in this matchup. Renfree destroy eight for Croc. Okay, sure. Renfree destroy eight for Croc could be a way. And then what about for Yustiana? Yustiana's a little bit. Uh oh. He plays Compass. So there's dire bear there's dire bear concerns as well. There's Arnagad concerns. Dire bear, Arnagad, Combi. Combi's not that much of a concern. We have last say. We just have to make sure. We discarded a Bjorn. Scout for Dire Bear. So we're keeping Scout as our last card. We need Destroy 8. Yeah, Destroy 8 helps with Arnagad and Croc and Dire Bear. <clears throat> Scout is a nice answer for Dire Bear. Croc is a, is a scary thing. Sunset Wanderers is for there to thin for the, uh, for the compass. Squirrel? 
Squirrel to get rid of the supremacy could be fine. We have one pincer maneuver that we can use to get like PFI, I suppose, to help with the croc. Uh, man, I kind of want to move this. I kind of want to move this, but like, if he goes Dire Bear, and we don't find the eight, the pride on this, it's... <sighs> okay, I don't think we... I, I guess we have to save it, right? I guess we have to save it, because we just don't have removal. If I had Serquan, I would maybe, like, feel better about not removing this, and then Serquan it later, but I don't have Serquan either. We could also like Wrath, Wrath Sabrina next to this and kill it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Scytheman is going to play for nothing, right? Yeah, I can't move Erlen with Ladder. Yeah, 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 I was thinking about that too. You think we should have played Renfri here? He's gonna kill some stuff, so that's why I'm trying to wait a little bit with the Pavetta for him to kill some stuff. He's getting so much armor, yeah. Envy, Greed, Lust. Greed. I could get hand buff from greed. Hand buff from greed to protect the Erlen from from uh, what's her face, Justiana. Patience, kindness. I missed. I don't get it again. I thought I get it. Wait, do I not get it again? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. No, no. Oh, I should have played Renfrey last turn. Fire. Dagger could have killed Boat. Oh yeah. No, Dagger could have killed Sabrina. Two. I can't kill Sabrina either. No, it's a huge throw. It's all falling apart. Take Run away, run free. <laughs> Oh god, he's got so much damage. I'm gonna have no I'm gonna have nothing on the board. We're dead. I think Erlen's dead. Dog for Mata. <laughs> Dude, I'm thinking about it. I'm I'm re I'm really thinking about it. Dog for Mata. Mata extends the, the round. We get an extra greed. Then if then Mata also has a 50-50 to get Iris. <laughs> oh man.
<laughs> it's crazy. But is it? Is it that crazy? We're going to discard something really important. We're going to discard something really important, though. <laughs> okay. Bug it. Bug it for the memes! For the memes! Okay, nice! That was the Sabrina! Oh, that was the best outcome! I think that was the best outcome. We get to keep our bear tech. We get to keep... I just thinned for him, though. Wait, what if he didn't have thinning? Okay, he had the thinning. The Yastiana's gone too. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> I'm dying. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve revenants again. You <laughs> win, this is a YouTube game. Totally. Totally. 50 50! Marie's cultures connect. We didn't get the Iris. But, I mean, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Iris is a lot of points. Iris is 19 points. But Ser Kwan. Ser Kwan kills a boat. So that's not too bad either. Go beyond, become more. Decoction is definitely not in his deck, right? Definitely no decoction. Justiana's gone. Compass. He's gonna go for Dire Bear. He's gonna go for Dire Bear. Oh god, what if he has another Corsair? Oh no. Corsair would be brutal here. Corsair would kill us. We'd be super dead to Corsair. Okay, but he doesn't have a Corsair in the graveyard, so he can't, like, Fakusia Corsair either. Svalblood? Could Svalblood kill me? No, because he can't transform his... He can't transform his, uh, his own unit. His own fanatic. Should we have click lamp? Um, lamp kind of lamp doesn't even protect against Corsair. He just double leaders it and then double pings these ones. <coughs> oh! Um. Uh. What's his last card, chat? It's. It's a tall punish, right? It's like COC. I don't think we can click this. Wait, wait, wait. We play the scout now. We play the scout now. Because... Because uh, compass is gone. Don't buy this. You want to discard scout? Why? Scout plays for one point. Even if we... Scott plays for one point. What's the upside of discarding? Yeah, but Scout prevents this from hitting the Renfries gang, though. So. <clears throat> yeah.
Yeah, baby! I think we're winning! <laughs> and we get the green again! We're winning, chat! <laughs> it's a huge win! We had zero interactable points. Fudge! It's so small! The Ireland is so small! <laughs> oh no, we're not winning! <laughs> oh man! Oh. We needed the Iris, and even if we had the Iris, I think we probably still lose. Embarrassing Erlen. <laughs> Even if we had the iris, I think we still lose there. We can't lose, Psychoki! <laughs> still a good YouTube game, to be honest. No, we lost by like 14 or so. The iris plays for 19, remember? The iris plays for 19. Like, we discard the iris, or we play the iris and he kills the iris. It plays for 19 either way, right? We, we discard the iris, it plays for 19. But this, but the boat, not the boat, the the Serquan, the Serquan played for four plus. It removed a four, and then it. Uh, the Serquan played for like five points, not that much. Everything died, everything died. So removing the boat only takes away a point from Erland and takes away a point from the Renfries gang, is which one we played last. So it's only, the Seracorn was 6 points, Iris was 19 points, so it's 13 point difference. <coughs> oh, but if the boat lives, if the boat lives, the wild boar kills the Erlen, yeah. That's true. Holy cow. <coughs> he didn't, th he didn't think about... He didn't think about the possibility of bear, of dire bear. He didn't think about the possibility of dire bear. Like, we didn't need to keep the scout. We could have used the scout on the boat, and then used, and then, like, not needed the Serquan, and got the Erland. Not the Erland, but the, the Iris. If we got the Iris, not needed the Serquan, then maybe we could win or tie or something. He should have Hemdalled. Nah, Hemdall doesn't... No, Hemdall is three pings. Three pings, three units. It's very unlikely to kill the Erlen. And then after he Hemdalls, he has no... He has no wild boar. Hemdall is pretty power corrupt, but like... How do you make him good without making him, like, just good in, in non-synergistic decks? Onward. Attack. Like, you gotta buff, like, Ulula and stuff to make him be good enough to play in a niche synergy deck, but not so good that you just throw him in every deck. Him not taking Dire Bear? Yeah, him not taking Dire Bear is a bit sus. But Dire Bear, honestly... Would have been very good still too. It would have been more points than the wild boar of the sea because the wild boar ends up overkilling stuff. Oh my god! <clears throat> so that was a real game. Uh, shield wall can play AA. This for. Scout can move the Immortals. <coughs> We've tanned their black clad hides at Sodden. We'll tan their black clad hides again. That's annoying. So it's Shield Wall alumni. I think it's Shield Wall alumni. I could double, I could scout this and scout Letitia, but like, 
I think he will have a movement of his own. Is my guess. Can't take it anymore. We don't really have any control in this deck, except maybe run free. Finally. Oh, it's full test. <laughs> <coughs> Hmm, okay. We have a new plan? New plan. We draw him the Dun Banner. <laughs> Do not make me beg. And then we use Renfrey to kill Foltest. Or we use Renfrey to kill Donamir. But probably need to kill Foltest. Uh, he has a Crystal Skull, so we not, might not even be able to kill the Foltest. But I would have to use all my leaders now. Yeah, how do we even kill this? We didn't draw him the Dun Banner. No, drawing the Dun Banner is still good because drawing him the Dun Banner means that he, um, <clears throat> he, uh, has to play a four or a zero. He has to play like a zero if we draw him a dumb banner. too hard. I kind of I wanted to play Renfri this turn. <clears throat> but I'm roping too hard. Oh, stick Sabrina in between is actually really good. But if I stick Sabrina in between, how do I kill Sabrina afterwards? <laughs> hmm. How many turns is it going to take? If I go like Draug, transform, then next turn I could go Scout, and then I also have to go Renfrey. <sighs> All right, screw it. No, he has movement, right? <clears throat> this deck has movement for sure. It plays double Siege Ladder. I don't think sticking Sabrina in between is going to do anything. Sorry. I think that's wrong. Renfrey is a human. But I think we have still have to do this first. I think I just want to start copying Revenants ASAP. <clears throat> There's AA and Oniromancy. So we should banish the... I think we should banish the Oniromancy because he might have trouble getting Renew. This deck with AA and Oniromancy, it's probably playing Pavetta and Renew. <laughs> the Board of Ethics would never allow it. Never. Yeah, they're doing our strategy with Dunbanners instead of Revenants, exactly. Wait, he just, he just activated his Fall Test on Blue Stripe Scout. Lol. I don't know if I even want to kill Fall Test anymore. Yeah, we just see oh, what Renfrey rolls, I guess. Sloth, Envy, Greed. Probably just Envy. <clears throat> cool, <laughs> cool down? No. 
kindness? No pride. That's fine. Not great, but whatever. We can still win this round. Maybe. I don't know. I, I The problem is now I have these two unplayable cards in my hand. Like, we got rid of the pincer maneuver, so we can no longer mulligan or play. Like, can't play this stuff. <laughs> oh my god Battles are won or lost by the commanders Not by sorceresses There's the siege ladder. <clears throat> We're kind of expecting that. Finally. Are we going to envy in this round? I would like to save Envy for later. <laughs> uh, if it means winning the round, yeah, we need to win the round. I guess we don't click yet. Oh, I should have cycled this. I think we don't click yet. You might double leader Sabrina. Maybe. Whatever. I can still I can still deal with that for now. I'm running out of turns though. I think we probably have to envy now, but I don't know if envy actually wins us the round. <clears throat> okay, so <clears throat> Don't buy this. I haven't done the math. <laughs> and I don't think we're gonna do the math. I think we just... Oh god, I missed points on kindness! Shoot. I definitely missed points on kindness somewhere. Could have also played this on the on like I don't know something back here, but he would have gotten another four. Mm, okay, we're we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Commands are sacred. They must be treated as such. Oh no, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. For the king! <clears throat> okay. So mm -hmm. now we go short now we go straight to round three, right? Hey, Mosh. How's it going? Radovid doesn't do anything anymore. <laughs> what was that? What do we want? We want Serquan, we want Iris. We need to get the Iris somehow. Um, 
Revenant, is that any good? I don't think so. I want to say no. Iris, okay. Straight to round three because... Huh. Actually, I don't know. Maybe we should have 2 0 would him. <clears throat> Shoot. Maybe I should have tried for a 2 0. He has the AA, though. He's He drew the Pavetta and he still has the AA to get the Dung Banners. And he's the one who probably has Renew. I don't have Renew. He has a three round game plan. I really only have a two round game plan. <clears throat> he had location click as well, yeah. Sir Quan, good. This is a six. This is like a like a five. Wait, no, we have we have um we have kindness. We have kindness buffs. So this is actually pretty decent. We missed. I don't know what we missed. We missed Iris Companions, but I don't think Iris Companions is actually that good. <clears throat> it's like four extra points. Oh, Scout. Okay. Next is Pavetta. Then, after Pavetta is discard Iris. <coughs> this still gets him some points. Maybe we go like PFI first. PFI first to get the kindness. Then when Pavetta gets a kindness. Then discard this. He does he did draw the renew anyways. Yeah, Immortal's still working on range. I have a feeling we're losing. I have a feeling we are losing chat. Five. They only have ten revenants this time. We only have ten revenants this time. This will be last card. Erlen's not that big. Erlen's like 40 points. 38 points. Alert to arms! Wait, Erlen before the above. Ren Freeze game? So that we can get one extra point on Erlen? On the Ren Freeze game before thinning? I played a little bit, a tiny little bit of Shoop Assimilate Henry. With double cross, it was just kind of whatever. Very reliant on Henry RNG. Alert to arms! <laughs> Finally. Okay. You heard about Trident Ultimate. Bloody non humans. Is this winnable? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine damage. <clears throat> the Scytheman's actually doing fairly well here. It's going to be five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten points. Nine points now? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, still nine points now? 
Do I have two evens? No, I don't have two evens. It's not gonna be enough to though. A time to sow. Oh my god! Oh. What? After all that? Did I lose a point somewhere? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Wait, I... Wait, Chad, I threw! Did I throw? No. Erland was already buffed. Erland was already buffed. I couldn't get two evens. I thought I fought for a second that Erlen wasn't buffed yet, and then I played the Scytheman before I clicked the Erlen. Damn, that was so close. We lost two. Of Did I just lose three MMR for a draw? Am I am I hallucinating? I think I just lost three MMR for a draw. Opponent clicked the artifact one turn late. Yeah, they did, but they needed it for to buff the the Dun Banner in the back row. <clears throat> yeah, it was one one one. I had twenty. I was twenty four seventy five. I just lost three MMR for a draw. That's like ridiculous. How is that even possible? <laughs> Wait, what? There are some games where you can lose 3 MMR for a loss. Like, that's... If you are super low MMR compared to your opponent, you can you can lose as little as 3 MMR for a loss. And I just lost 3 MMR for a draw. It was Love KJH, I think. He was 23-17. 2317 compared to R2475. We were 160, 160 MMR higher than him. Am I doing better than Imagawa did? Oh, 111 is our is our record. We're one one win, one loss, one draw. You once stole four MMR from Kuner with a draw. That's crazy. Imagawa went zero and two. Oh, really? The deck has like very little control. It has very little control, and it honestly doesn't have that many points. The deck doesn't have that many points, right? Surprised they let they match people with that large of a gap. It just depends on how long you're searching for. <clears throat> Yeah, the deck's not good. It's just fun. <coughs> okay. Oh, man. That's, we had two draws today already, right? I think there was another game where we tied. Don't make me laugh. Oh, yeah? Nice. Pincer Maneuver. Crystal Skull. Pinsum Maneuver most likely um, is like Molitole or Priestess. This gives us run free. We gotta keep. <clears throat> I think we mulligan those because we have a pretty good hand already. I don't need to spend that many mulligans or spend that many leaders. Seems doable. So this guy's this is Renfree. This is probably Renfree Priestess. Renfree Priestess can kill our Erland with pings. Is uh, the scary thing. I can mad at him. I can mad him late in round three. But does that really do anything? It breaks up his combo, gives me an extra card. <coughs> it gives me an extra card, it breaks up his combo, and then, I don't know. Can't take it anymore. 
It breaks up his combo, but I have to be able to kill his stuff for it to really matter when I'm breaking up his combo. So I need removal from, like, Sarah Kwan, removal from Renfri, and that's kind of it. I don't really have any other removals. Removal for Sarah Kwan or Renfri. And he's also Renfri Priestesses. Oh, it's not Renfri. He's playing Temple. Wait, okay. So it's Erlen Shoop? Everything's different now. Now it's Erlen Shoop? Hmm. <laughs> Which one of these can I mulligan? This? Does mostly play Iris? No, it doesn't. Do not test <clears throat> my patience. Maybe I can mulligan the scout. Maybe I'm supposed to actually mulligan the scout. Because I can play this PF... No, oh, because uh, the, the Draug only transforms units on one row, right? Make it, maybe I can mulligan the PFI. I want to get the Voimir, but I also wanted to keep the Scytheman, but I just have too many cards in hand. Here comes the Muta. Uh. Dude, like his Erlen's gonna be his Erlen's gonna be the same size as ours. It's so sad. Oh, I've been playing Draug on the wrong row. I just realized. That I've been playing Draug in the wrong row this whole time. I can play Draug on the other row and not on the same row as the Revenants. <clears throat> I kept wondering why you were doing that, but you always had movement, yeah. I mean, it still matters a little bit. Death awaits us all. Um. We retreat. We hide. Someone to defend. All of us. Tomorrow we stop at home. I think this is fine. We still have four revenants. What did he create off of this? DJ, Varaxis, Philippa. Oh god, they're all so good! <clears throat> Philippa can RNG kill our Erland. Varaxis gets him another duel. DJ is good too. Like, DJ is doubling this. This is now two points every two turns. I think we're playing the Sabrina now. Nado I want to blow with this. Fight me, kill! I think. For the king! I think this should be fine. 
Yeah, he probably has to pass. Maybe. His tallest... He's got, like, a 20 point on Seiya. 22 point... 21, 25 point on Seiya. <clears throat> he has no more leader charges. 25 point on Seiya. It only gives him to 29. He still needs another 20 points. He probably should pass here. We went on even. There's still a lot of ways for him to kill our Erlen, though. There's... There's Philippa. There's Shoop. Yeah, minus six provisions is so much. So, I think we just open with this. We're bleeding, right? How much a muta generator value did he get? One, two. He only got ten muta generator value. I'm dead serious. <laughs> oh man, the greed, the bruh. Dude, really? <sighs> Shit. I'm scared about Shoop Transform. I'm actually really scared about Shoop Transform. Yeah, we're leadering plus cat. That's the plan. But I'm scared that, like, because I took a good card, like, what if he just decides to shoot transform here and now we lose our Pavetta? That would be very bad. Dude, did he hear me? Okay, he took 13 damage because he wanted to clear the board. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. It's fine. Shoop gone. That's one answer gone. One answer, one thing that can potentially answer Erland is gone. This deck can no longer play an Igni, right? There's no way it's ever fitting Igni anymore after the six provision loss. Long live, etc. etc. <laughs> we have one more leader. I can leader Erland and then. And then Mata the Iris. But if I want to leader Erland, I gotta get rid of something in my hand. <clears throat> I could also just not play the Mata in this round. That's also fine. Although I would I would like to play the Renfrey in this round. It gives me a lot of carryover. With me, you forget your sorrows. We at least have the Iris, <clears throat> if not the Iris companions. I don't think we go. I don't think we care about points in this round anymore. After he played the Shoop deal thirteen, we can't really win the round anymore. With or we can't really like get double last say anymore. Get this down. And I don't really need any of these cards, right? So I think. I think the plan is okay. We play Renfrey first. If the round is too small, then Philippa has a chance of killing Erlen is much higher. Oh, that's true. The only good mage 
is a dead mage. Gluttony, wrath, pride. <clears throat> hmm. They all kind of suck. Definitely not gluttony. Wrath or pride? I guess wrath. Because I could threaten his Erland with wrath. I was hoping for random deal six. Random deal six would have been nice. Can we buff Erland on drop? <clears throat> uh, yeah, maybe with the Curse of Wrath. Oh, Phyllis is gone. Phyllis is gone. That's actually really good too. Um. Let's go Pavetta now. Our Pavetta is not getting any better. We don't need to draw anything, right? There's nothing in here that we really, really need. So it's okay to clog ourselves with a bunch of revenants, and maybe we get a six power revenant. 27 cards in deck now. Like, yeah, you could have some one power revenant bricks, but like, I don't think that's a big deal. Like, all the other cards in our deck suck anyways. Not like we have amazing cards left to draw into. Why do we discard? So that it... Why not? You don't off, like to discard? You won't. So it buffs three extra units. If we discard, it buffs three extra units. If we play, it only activates after we draw our cards in round three. I guess it doesn't matter. Wait. Yeah, no, it's three extra points. It's three extra points. Oh, you don't know what a card does. It, um... When it when it's in your graveyard at the end of the turn, it will banish herself and then buff all of your car all of your units in your deck by one. Is there any chance we want to trade a Renfries gang? A 14 power Renfries gang. It's his card in his hand is on Seus and something else. What if his last two cards are on Seus and Erland? I think we just pass. If it was on Seus and Erland, we would want to play the Renfries gang. It would be a good trade to play the Renfries gang. Honestly, maybe it's Erland. Maybe it's Erland, I don't know. He has no leader charges anymore. Shoot. we keep this hand? Because we have a brick here. These are kind of bad. <laughs> I think this is okay. To the dungeon with it. Damn. I got the route of it. I don't feel great about this. You're about Troy Dam Ultimate. Uh. Hmm. Oh God! A duel! To a duel I challenge thee! He has a Varaxis now. Yeah, I feel like maybe his last card in his hand was Erland. Maybe we should have played the the gang. I don't think he has any other Erland removals. I do think we can play it now. Suffering? 
Our suffering binds us. Our Erland is bigger than his Erland, yes. But he's got way more points than us. We're playing three fives. Maybe not. Maybe these will kill these. <coughs> Maybe he'll play his Erland next to the volunteer. Philip has played. Shoop has played. There shouldn't be anything left. This won't be Too bad we don't have a Sabrina still. <laughs> that would be nice if we had a Sabrina. We retreat. We hide. So Vondergriff says. Wrath on Varaxis. Oh damn! Yeah, shit. Ah, Miss points. <clears throat> Wrath on Varaxis. Gets me an extra like five. That's pretty big. I gladly help. I live to see it. Dang it. Okay. Thirty-four? <laughs> Fifty-one point Erlen! Oh my god! Look at the deck! It's massive! This was our best Pavetta, I think. I think the bet this is our biggest Pavetta because I don't think we had 23 cards in the deck before in round three. That's 46 points of Erlen boost. His sad little Erlen only 29. Easy! How are we winning these games, man? But our opponent really, he didn't know the deck. Our opponent didn't know the deck. He had some potential answers for the Erland, but he didn't save them. Entropy. I think it's like three days in a row we played Entropy one time each. Okay. <sighs> Off the books. Probably want Squirrel. Scout could be good for like Freak Show if there's a Freak Show. I think we just don't want that. We don't want this. Okay. We need to get Draug. And maybe Voimir. I should mulligan Renfri's gang, I think. This way. Upstairs. Consider this my tip. Gross. <laughs> That's so gross. Can't take any more. Any diamonds for little old me? Hmm. <laughs> ha ha, Mashka. <clears throat> Obviously, this is not the deck that it matters in. Abandon your false. Guns. <laughs> Draug. <clears throat> I think we don't want two more revenants. And we maybe also go get Voimir. Oh, I should have gotten Sabrina. Maybe we we'll also go get Sabrina.
<laughs> this is so many leaders. Uh... Uh-oh. I see a problem. I don't have a leader for both Pavetta and Erland. But it's okay. Mata will draw us the other one. You, yes, you. <clears throat> have uh -oh. you made your offering? Too bad development died before they could add up four engines in one card turn. Yeah. What the high roll? You know, He has nothing to squirrel. <clears throat> Maybe I should have gotten rid of the squirrel. For the king! We retreat! We hide! So Vandergrift says! Let's just play this now. Um... Or do we? Squirrel boat? I haven't seen a boat yet. We could play Renfri's gang now. That's maybe okay too. Boss doesn't like you. The words <clears throat> oh wait that's fine that's actually fine he didn't click this did he forget or he knows the sabrina is coming why not the tokens because they're all their tokens are going to die from sabrina anyways i want to get more revenants in my graveyard I think it's now Scout. Don't buy this. Wait. <clears throat> Four. Six. We're not ahead. I have I think I'm gonna have to do this now. Battles are won or lost by the commanders. Not if I if I play Scout, I don't think we're ahead. Whoops. Almost. Almost clicked that, even though I have no space. Hey, look, Madame is ba Madame Serenity is balanced. <laughs> We're winning on even against tr three in one engine, Madame Serenity. Hoggers. Three power yes. finally balanced her. Look, like, we we only needed three pinks instead of four pinks to kill her. Quan is pretty good. I think, as long as we're still winning on even, I think I'd rather focus on... Um, I'd rather focus on, like, getting more revenants. And then we can always Serquan late. Like, it doesn't matter how big these engines grow to, right? We can Serquan late and still get... We're getting 17 damage right now with Serquan. Or uh, whatever, something like that. No, uh, Bob Buttons. There will be no more reworks other than powers and provision changes. Serquan can turn into... Do we already have Revenants that can turn into Revenants? Hmm, <laughs> Is there any of the squirrel yet? There's no boat. He would have tried to get the boat out by now if, if there was a boat. I think we're just gonna get rid of the squirrel later. We retreat! We hide! So Vandergrift says! Short weapons in array. Huh? He'll probably pass now. We're up 25. Hmm. 
No. <clears throat> wow, still not passing. If they play far down enough, we might just 2-0. Yeah, maybe. I can also, like, Revenant get rid of the shield and encircle on this. Another little thunderbolt. I think we pass after the Sirquan. I can't use my last leader. I need to naturally draw one of the Pavetta or the Erlen so that I can leader the other one. It's not that many points, dude. He has 12 coins. He has 12 coins with this Oxford Guard out. I'm not actually sure if I should... I think I guess this is this is seven more points than this already. Eight more points than this already. It's already four clicks worth, right? So I guess we do want to kill this instead of this. He can easily make the points earlier before the circle. What do we gain by trading cat? Cat isn't very good later. We don't actually swarm later. We only swarm in round one. Cat only kills small stuff later, I think. Ground control is good. Mata is really good here. And that's also very good. We just want a short round three. Can can off the books kill Erland? They have Salamandra Mage that can maybe damage an immune unit. Brawler. Brawler is the scary thing. Okay. <clears throat> Nothing to squirrel, right? He's non devotion. So he probably plays Heat Wave. Do I need anything really badly? No. I have the Erlen. So I think it's Pavetta now. Well, I, I can. But also Renfri first. I think we'll just go for that. Out. 14 revenants. We only have revenants in the. Oh no. Oh, wait, we don't only have revenants in the graveyard. 14 revenants. What does Mata get? Mata gets me Erland. But I think I could maybe even consider playing it in round three. There should be no way he plays Igni or COC. You want a 2 0? The eternal fire shall consume all that is impure. Maybe. We can we can kind of like feel it out. We can kind of feel it out to see. Why not discard? Oh wait, are you just impersonating in impersonating Favetta? No! Brawler is less scary on round two board. There's a heat wave. Wait, he thinks it's a triple. He thinks it's a renew Pavetta deck. He has twelve coins. He has twelve coins, which is quite scary. <clears throat> yeah, it's Batiste. Go ahead, feel it. Greed for protection. Ah, oh, the patience again. Kindness for protection. Okay. Best not play with fire. Oopsies. We dance. <laughs> for young is the night. <clears throat> I don't have that much power on the board. I have... 
This positively reeks of heresy. Okay, let's see here. We have 10, 15, 16, and then green. Okay, let's let's go for it. Let's go for it. There's not there's no way he's gonna have enough coins. I have 10, 15, 16, and then when I leader, I'm gonna get more too. I'm gonna probably get at least five more on the leader. So it's gonna be 21. He can't brawl or 21 power. I think I just lose two points if I take this, right? I feel like we should just take the TA. I think I would just lose two points if we take this. Or three points, because this would be even then. We've to rise above, go beyond, become more. <clears throat> Sova! <laughs> 48 boost in the deck. Incoming Blizzard. Woo! It's over! GG Entropy! In before COC. There's no way there's a COC in this deck. He's still playing. He's gonna see how much he has. A lot of coins. Yago? No. Off the books wouldn't play Yago. Ah, okay. First form Saint Gregory. Oh wow. I think he did 40 points. I think he did 40 something points in that last turn. It was actually kinda close. Holy Alright, that was impressive. I didn't think it was gonna be that close. I thought it was gonna be a landslide. 